What's poppin' fams? It's Spanik, coach of your Alabama Crimson Surf. And today it's week one of the WNBA Season 2 as we look to defend our title in the semifinals rematch against Derpinator 3001 and the Niagara Weaviles. If you want to know what I'm bringing, I have a team builder video up for this game, so you should check that out. His team, though, I expect the dual Scarfers here with Gengar and Mianxiao. And other than that, I pretty much, he brought nothing out of the irregular. I expected a lot of his stuff. I, like I said in the team builder, I didn't expect Florges, I didn't expect Gladias, and he didn't bring both of them, which is completely fine by me. So, good luck, have fun, Derp, and let's see how this game panned out. I lead with Porygon Z, as he leads with Steelix. So here, no Florges, man, I was free to trick on anything I wanted. So I chose the Steelix, as this thing's a massive threat. It came down in between Steelix or Minior, and I chose Steelix because of the massive threat it is to things like Weavile. And it turns out, he has a Z-move on the Steelix, so Trick did not work. So, I'm getting played turn one here. That's beautiful. As he, I believe he gets up rocks here. Yeah, he does. So, I switch into Weezing, because Steelix cannot touch my Weezing. As he misses the Dragon Tail, that's fine. I was here predicting the Venusaur, but he actually goes out in the Gengar, trying to make an aggressive play early. I see you, derp. So, now let's see what he does here. I switch into Vape, best switch by far. And he goes into... And he reveals the sub here. I could exhale. No Z move because of the Steelix. No Scarf. Unless he brought Scarf sub, for some reason. Which I doubt. So, yeah, so Gengar reveals the sub. No Z move, no Scarf. That's fine. He switches now into Venusaur as I click Skull to try to break the sub. Maybe land a burn on the Venusaur. I don't get the burn on the Venusaur. He Megas. I protect Scouting for Sleep Powder or Leech Seed as he Gigas. Okay, he switches into Bird as I switch into Marowak. He predicted me right there. Alright, that's fine. He U-turns. believe I clicked Shadowbone here to kill the Gengar. Yep. No fire resist. Really hurt and derp right now. As he goes into Steelix, I switch into Vape. He is, and here's the Z-move revealed. It's Tectonic Rage for my Marowak. Because, yeah, it turns out he, I was thinking either, when I, when Steelix revealed the Z-move, I immediately thought, okay, it's either Gigavolt Havoc, or it's Tectonic Rage for Marowak. Turns out it's Tectonic Rage for Marowak, which is excellent for my Vaporeon. Meaning now Vaporeon does so much more damage this game. It's able to wall things like Talonflame. Because I have a mixed defensive set for Talonflame and Gengar, but Gengar's dead. So this thing's going to be specifically for Talonflame. So let's let's continue on. As I get up a wish, he details me into Deancey here. Can't mega on this thing, so I switch into Vape again. As he Earthquakes and Vape with the tank right away. Vape doing what it does best, taking hits. So he switches into Venusaur. That seems to be his preferred Vape answer. As I protect again, still scouting for Sleep Powder or Leech Seed, as he Giga Drains. I pretty much at this point think he doesn't have either. As I switch into Weezing, him revealing Toxic clinches that. So he switches now into Talonflame. I Sludge Bomb for damage on something not named Steelix. Here he U-turns, going into, I think, yeah, Steelix. So now he gets initiative with the Steelix. This thing was a monster for the entire game. He goes into Venusaur. I whisk the Venusaur. Finally, burn it. Gets some residual. There's the Synthesis. I Sludge Bomb for damage. I think he switches into Talonflame here. Yeah, he does. As I Sludge Bomb for damage. And here he goes for Brave Bird and gets a crit. That crit sucked. Because now the Mian Shao could pick me off. As it, as it will in this next turn. So, yeah, but that, but because it picked me off, I thought he was scarfed here. I pretty much confirmed he was scarfed here. Yeah, so I get the free Mega, and I get the Psychic off on something. He went into Venusaur, so Venusaur just, it's it's dead. I Earth Powered there, just in case he went into Steelix to try to be cheeky. Now I go Steelix. I'm, I think he was sturdy here, so I went into Vaporeon. EQs does nothing. I click Scald here, and it does a monster ton. So as he details me out, I believe into yeah, PZ. So I have my only play here is Psychic. Definitely my only play there was Psychic. 
As he goes mini or psychic again because I want damage. As he shell smashes. Here I thought I lost. I thought he was about to reverse sweep me right here. But okay, yeah, there's the acro. And here I thought, yep, GG. I thought I lost. But nope, Weavile comes in clutch right now. Boom! That is one dead Minior. And that's going to be the game. As Miyag Mr. Miyagi over here, the Manchow, is scarfed. So he can lock himself in one move. He chooses knockoff. But as you can see, I sh as you can see Weavile here tanking the knockoff, preserving the 4 0 win and the 1 0 start for the Crimson Surf. Hashtag roll out. GG Derp. Nice, well played game between the two of us, as it always should be. I hate doing post comms because I gotta try to rethink what I went through already. Next week's game, we play take on Sir Bacon 12 and the Fall River Floatzels. And that game will be live commed. Same time, same place. Hispanic out. <laughs>